Hey, what's poppin' guys? Sizzle here, and welcome to episode 28, I believe. Might be wrong on that. It's really hard to tell. I haven't edited most of them yet. Um, so I'm gonna go either way and go do exactly what I described last time. And if I can actually type. Portal hub. And, uh, you know, kill spiders. That's worded. And if there's spider bosses, I'm gonna kill those too and hopefully get the last piece of armor that I need. But, uh, you know, the chance of someone also doing that, well, not also, the chance of someone running a spider boss while we're here is not particularly amazing. So we'll see. Wait, I'm at Bestiary Milestone 3? I thought I could upgrade my pet with every milestone. Have I been have I been slacking? Have I had pet upgrades just sitting there? I probably have been. I also just realized I've gotten a good amount of string over the last few episodes and I haven't I don't think I've tried to upgrade the uh, spider minions in any way. So I might have been just wasting a lot of time. Uh, also, while I was sitting there in, you know, in time lapse mode, I was I was thinking and I was you know, looking at what I had, and I kind of realized, you know, my armor's almost completely unenchanted, so that's something I have to work on as well. But and I thought about it some more. I'm like, you know, would I rather have a weapon that's one shotting things to grind, so like while, while I'm getting the other half of the experience? Oh, you can see, yeah, uncommon. See milestone four to get it to rare, so that's that's yeah. We're not that far behind, but what is what do we actually get with uncommon? Do we get any kind of perks? I also hate how this plays like music, and the only way to turn that off is to turn off player noise. And then there's even more with hostile creatures. So if I have either of those sounds on, I hear this annoying jingle everywhere I go. And it's, it's you know it's slowly just slowly driving me insane. Um, but anyway, let's see. Uh, pets. More health and strength than I remember seeing before. And combo starts giving us magic find right away, then four coins a kill at 10. I mean, this just seems like we get more per kill combo, which is very nice. I also notice we now have a fishing bag, which uh, I don't really know what the point of that is. I can hold bait, I guess that's useful. Remember, the quiver is useful. This is where you put all your arrows. But, uh. Anyway, yeah. I just thought I'd bring that up, that, you know, we're still definitely upgrading the sword, but I also have to work on the armor as well. It's probably a good thing that we need a shit ton of string right now. Um, anyway, gonna get back to the grind. I know I'm supposed to have 45 levels and not 30 whenever I'm coming back to upgrade, but I kind of forgot what I have available in here and I figured I might as well actually go check that out. Um, so what do we have? Cleave seems completely like not that big, but mildly useful. For 50 XP it's definitely not essential. Uh, critical 
pretty big. I mean, this would increase my damage from 900 currently with crit to like 1500, which would be pretty massive. Um, this one doesn't seem particularly useful for now, but it could be useful later. This one uh, doesn't matter right now, but can be nice later. I mean, that's not that bad to have. It just means I regen more, which there's no real downside to. Um, this doesn't remove sharpness, which I thought it did. I guess you get sharpness and something like this. Uh, Slimes, Magnacuse, Creepers is the smaller group. Uh, luck is a useful one, but it's 50 levels. Critical leading on 50 levels. Scavenger. 30 levels and we just get raw coins as we're killing stuff which is useful uh, looting we have a looting four book so there's no reason to ever get this experience is probably actually what we want to get because um, right now we need experience to keep leveling stuff with us so we're gonna that's the goal is to do more of that uh, i do also want to try this i haven't done this yet i think we'll do it i will use a lot of XP here, but it didn't take that long to get, so fuck it. So, Cocoa Bean. Okay, Cocoa Bean. Uh, Leather. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Power 4. I don't have a bow right now, so whatever. Gain 3 clicks. Nice. Okay, purple dye. Blue dye, blue dye. There we go. Yellow. Oh, okay, leather's down here. Leather. Nice. Okay. Unlucky. But yeah, 75,000 enchanting XP. Plus 7,000 enchanting XP. Plus power and luck. Let's see, our enchanting just went from, what, 15, uh, 14 to 15, just outright. We got 1,300 coins. A true protection enchantment. Which, I don't know where the hell that is in here. But, uh, Vampirism heals 6% of your missing health when you kill an enemy. This just seems like a better, uh, whatever that one other one was. Vampirism. I don't know how I use that or get to that, or is it just in the enchanting table? No, I don't really know. Oh yeah, next page. Oh wow, we have even more. Increases damage to end stuff. This is probably what I must spend a lot of time with, like killing Endermen and whatnot. So, Ender Slayer is probably what I want to get over Cubism. And that's 40 XP levels, but that's not essential for now. Um, Thunderlord, I remember. That's a, that's a decent one. This one's interesting. Reduces defense per hit. Sif Siphon, Siphon. Yeah, Siphon's the right one. Heals... Your, ha your max health per 100 crit damage you deal per hit up to a thousand. Interesting. It just heals more than vampirism. Just just heals a lot when you like kill something. However, goal is still going to be the experience one, which is 45 levels. So we will sit here until we do that. Luck 4 is a nice book to have as well, I guess. Maybe we have to make an anvil. Let's see. Yeah, luck four, looting four, and power four are all stuff we have. Uh, combat XP boost, we're about to do combat, so I might as well drink these before I forget they even exist. Um, before we go back to that, I'm going to go drop off our coins in the bank. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy the rest of this time lapse. Wait, I could have done this the whole time. I was getting like super pissed at all those random mob noises and stuff. All I had to do was toggle music. I'm... 
Why is that even on by default? I mean, I, I know why it's on by default, but why is that like so hidden to turn off? Why couldn't they have it all be jukebox music? Why did it have to be like spider music? That's really annoying. Anyway, back to the grind. I just thought I'd point that out. Wait, 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 wait. Hold the fucking phone. Why do I have 13k? Oh, 10,000 coins, 1 out of 28 relics. Wait, so that was a relic. Wait, so those things are relics, just that the thing that was just sitting there out in the open. So I don't need that relic compass. I can actually walk around, maybe find some of that while killing some stuff. Oh. Got no W. I feel like it'll be pretty obvious where most of them are. If they're anything like that. Yeah, I'm actually taking too much damage. Hold up, hold up, hold the phone, hold the phone, hold the phone. Stop attacking, please. Please. I don't want to lose all my money. Oh, God. It's almost pretty bad.
Oh shit, someone's doing the spider boss. Let me uh, make my way over to that. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Please. Jesus. No! No! Please, no way did that just happen. I respawned right in front of the pad and they back me into it. Did I just lose all the rewards? Let's see. How fun slur is not in this lobby. Do I just lose all the rewards? I hope that's not the case, but if it is, god damn it. Anyway, back to the grind, I guess. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, boss fight again. This time, I'm not gonna get trolled. Unless it's just that guy putting in two, in which case, like, why? No, 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 no. Okay, okay, they're committing. I need to fucking make my way over. I don't care if I die and lose 2,000 coins, because I've got this 4,000 coins in like 10 minutes. Oh, and I'm also level 45, so once this boss fight's over. I get experience on this axe, and honestly, I'm probably going to call it there. But let's go there first. Fuck! I don't even know if that counted as hitting the thing. I died to, like, the mini boss. That guy died to him, too, so I don't know. Is there no one good in this lobby? Are we all like level two? Except these guys like fishing or whatever the fuck they're up to. Jesus, dude, I'm getting farmed. Wow, that's my first kill on one of the mini bosses, huh? <laughs> that's brutal.
That's probably my highest damage ever. I mean, 10,000. And that guy's spawning his thing. I don't think I'll mess with that. But let's see. Let's see if we get the, uh, the the drop that we needed. I forgot what chest plate or whatever. I mean, we got the fragment. I got another enchanted spider iron string. Um, yeah, we got another fragment, I guess. That's, that's something. But uh, yeah, I'm going to go enchant the Raider's Axe. Get that experience on it. And then uh, that'll probably be it for this episode. I mean, I did a lot here. Next episode, we, we kill more spiders, get more string. You know, you know how it is. Uh, there we go. Got our enchanting up another level. Got our axe up, another enchant. And, uh, yeah, let's, let's go drop off all this random shit in the chest. And then go uh, to the bank and drop off a bunch of our coins. And I'll figure it out from there. He's all really full. Jeez. I need like a rune chest too because they're they seem useless, but I'm getting a lot of them and a lot of uh duplicates, so it's kind of important if I keep getting a bunch of those to have a chest where they can stack. But anyway, we have 400,000 coins already. Jesus Christ, almost half a mil, and we're barely into the fucking series at all. Uh, let's use this to not even upgrade we don't have enough we actually don't even have a storage worm good thing i i did all this extra little shit we need to get ourselves a storage for our new uh iron minion because you know the whole point is to get enough iron collection for the enchanted hopper uh, and we're not gonna get there if it doesn't have extra storage so we gotta go do that we should also probably i don't know i don't know how we get to the decapitator faster because the faster we get to that the faster I can, like, max out all my log collections, get, like, max storage and all that, which would be very useful stuff. There we go, another one. Boom. Uh, if we had this before, we would have just been able to upgrade our Iron Minion, but, you know, it looks like we'll have to just do it next time that I hop on. But yeah, let's, uh... Let's go drop off the iron ingots in our newly found, newly founded uh, minion drop chest. And then uh, put down our small storage as well. So we get that out of the way. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.